your boy girl here back with another video and today we got a special video for y'all today we're gonna be showing how this character right here yes this old ex trunks can make these two characters even stronger than they already are and let me explain why so this is trunks if you check over here when he died like when first if he's alive he gives extra blast damage to when he switches out which you know both of those other two units are blast heavy units but when he dies he's going to give them 25% extra damage and on top of 50 per extra 50% damage inflicted to hybrid saiyans or gt which they're both hybrid saiyans and not only that when he's in he can also give them key when he switches out to standby and also he can heal up heal them up by 50% reduce their timer count give them extra damage so um yeah i've seen this from professor sensei's twitch channel you should check his um twitch you know he's a very very good twitch streamer he's like the top 10 pvp um player you know and i kind of got this idea off of him but instead of using instead of he used this guy but i'm, I'm instead using him because one of his one of his unique abilities is Whenever a trunks dies, he gets an extra 30% damage afflicted. And on top of that, since he dies, since trunks dies, he's actually a 50, is actually an extra 20% damage as well. So, you know, I feel like he would benefit from this trunks as well. You know, getting a lot of damage, and you know, that's a trunks, and he gets the damage afflicted as well, and just all sorts of tons of damage. And we all know about this Gohan. We all know, we all seen what he's doing to the PvP metal right now you know every time someone dies he heals up as well and getting extra damage and all sorts of damage stuff and i don't even know but uh yeah i mean i wanted to show but the um one thing one negative i have with this team is they all carry blast arts card so you're gonna be having a blast heavy deck when you're uh, in pvp so there's gonna be times where you're gonna just have four blast cards and it's gonna be kind of hard to initiate where you're trying to, you know, base someone's uh, vanish and then going with the strike attack, but you can't really do that because, you know, you don't have no strike cards, you have extra blast cards and, you know, facing Vegeta Blue and Kefla, they can just, you know, go through it. They can just break through it with their, um, with their little, um, the thing they have on their strike cards where they can just go through blast, blast armor, yeah, blast armor. So, um, yeah, um, and this team is not really the best in terms of tank. They're really squishy, so if you want to try to run this team, you got to really play pretty much perfect or else one one falls smooth and it's pretty much a dead unit. So, uh, yeah, we're going to go for three matches again. And, um, yeah, I'm going to catch you guys. Oh, sorry, my fault. Uh, I forgot to <laughs> show you guys the, uh, the equipment that I'm using for them. So, uh, here you guys go. Uh, here you guys. Um, and yeah, hold on. Let me show you guys this. And then we're gonna go to this Gohan. And yeah, now we can go to our three matches for this for today's video. Catch y'all there. All right, we're up against the um, GT team. We'll go to Gohan. He's gonna switch the baby. Should have kept that on the blast cord, but it's all good. It's all good. I'm doing some deal to get damage real quick, so I'm to tap. Alright. I'm transform. Even most likely gonna go to Super Saiyan 4 Goku. No, so we're gonna switch back to him. Go to Gohan. Alright. Okay, everything looking real good. X more damage afflicted since he switched out. Let me tap him out. That's all he got me. Blue card. So now we're gonna go to him. Don't really care if he dies or not. I mean, maybe we should get the heal. Or the buffs. Dodge. Heal up. If he dies, it is good. Alright. 
my green card. Okay, so we got him out the way. Let him get a damn stone. Let him take the rise of rush. Let's go with the strike. And we'll end it with uh, Future Gohan. You can get so much damage off of this. I'm trying to get a Rise Rush off of him, but he's not dodging. He still ain't dodging it. Let's see how much damage he can do. Hope he doesn't guess is it. He guesses it. Wow. Okay. Alright, let's just finish him off then. Alright, first game in the bag. Um Yeah, this team is looking okay. We're looking alright. So um I'm gonna catch you guys in the uh, in the next match. Alright, we're facing against Vegeta family. Gonna initiate. Okay. I gotta work on my drift. I'll be holding it for too long. Go on, this Gohan. Okay. Go and transform as well. Can I get a combo going? I'm gonna go with the strike. Yep. Alright, so we got some damage going, so. Alright, let's let's win this class real quick. Oh uh, yeah, that was pretty bad. Uh -huh. Take a little bit of damage from him. We're gonna go in just chunks. Heal up. Time to run away from the no. Right, took one of our opponents, uh, <coughs> took him out. All right, now they'll be real careful now. Take this back. Should be able. That should be a one shot. Yeah. That's dead. Yep. Yeah. Is he gonna one shot? Did he pop his main with this Monster Vegeta? Back for the 1v 1v3 comeback. Definitely is the best unit in my opinion. Wow, but this team is super glass cannon. Like, you gotta really play flawless with this team, but we got the dub, so I'm gonna see you guys in the last match of this video. Alright, we're facing against Fuses again. Oh, 
as well to strike. Alright, took him out. I'm gonna wait for him to, uh, yep. Yep, wow. We're going to Green Gohan. Guys, this. Let's see what damage he can do now. Alright. Use this blue card. And I still didn't kill. Oh, this ain't looking good. He gets the paint here, GG. So, we got the third match of this video. Uh, my thoughts on this team is not a, I don't think this is, this is not a PV viable team. Do not try to push the top 10K with this team. This is pretty much a fun team to use, you know, just to see how strong the green future Gohan and this Gohan can get after GT Trunks dies. But you can see throughout the three matches that this team doesn't really take, they don't take, um, they're not able to take hits, but they're able to initiate, like, big damage. So, um, if you're able to, you know, perfect, you know, your vanish and not get touched by the opponent, this team will be very deadly. But if you're someone like me that, you know, likes to likes to play aggressive, you know, likes to, you know, take risks of the opponent's perfect advantage to you and dealing out their combo, this isn't really the team for you. This is really an all glass cannon team, you know, they're dying, usually dying by like three strike strike attacks from Vegito Blue and Tefla and all and 21 and all sorts of strong units that's in this game right now. But uh, yeah, that's my thoughts on this team. This is a pretty interesting video I wanted to show you guys. You know, yeah, man. Like, please like, comment, and subscribe. It's your boy Green Ruff, and I'm out. Peace.